We are just over a month away from July 4th, and President Biden hopes our nation will inch closer to independence from the pandemic by hitting his goal of a 70% vaccination rate before the holiday. But reaching that goal won't be easy. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Suzanne joins us now live at the digital desk to explain why. Roger, here in Connecticut, we're doing our part though, right? Yeah, Nicole, we really are. Our state continues to be a vaccination leader, but some parts of the country really are falling behind. Now, as a result, there is a growing push to encourage skeptics to get the shot. President Biden calls June a month of action and encourages Americans to get vaccinated so they can enjoy this summer safely. A summer of freedom, a summer of joy, a summer of get-togethers and celebrations. An all-American summer that this country deserves after a long, long, dark winter that we've all endured. The president wants 70 percent of U.S. adults at least partially vaccinated by July 4th. Do it to protect those more vulnerable than you, your friends, your family. But reaching 70 percent won't be easy. So far, just 12 states, including Connecticut, have surpassed that goal. But overall, the nation sits at 63 percent and the daily vaccination rate is falling. President Biden hopes aggressive incentives will win over skeptics, but insists that Americans shouldn't take vaccine availability for granted. All over the world, people are desperate to get a shot. And later this hour, we'll detail some of the incentives that are being offered around the country, including some pretty compelling offers, including free beer, lotteries, and even gun giveaways. Live from the Digital Desk, I'm Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.